With you. That's gonna have to play until it goes off. So, everybody. So today, um, I don't have much to do on, but I do have three people I want to talk about really quick. Not talk about, but you know, discuss. Let's talk about such a bad word, and I don't want people to think I'm just here to blow down on people, because I'm not. That's not what I live for. So, but I will, however, bring y'all the juice on these three people. So. We're going to start off with, um, I don't know, who should we start with? Any mini mighty mo, cause I'm talking about any mighty mo, any mini mighty mo, and my mother says who picked the very best one and you are it. Mr. Diggy Simmons is the first one we're going to talk about. So apparently, Mr. Diggy Simmons is caught up in a sexting scandal. What's new? Album need a little boost. Leak a naked picture of yourself. No matter how old you are. Diggy's 16 years old. So apparently Media Takeout has a picture of Diggy Simmons in the nude, I'm assuming. They just said, um, what did they say? They didn't say naked pictures. They just said, like, um, explicit pictures of Diggy Simmons. And when I see the word explicit, I think nude pictures. I didn't click the link, because I don't care to see him naked. But apparently he has naked pictures out on the web. And the shit's gonna hit the fan. Your daddy is Rev Run, and you out sexting, and you 16. <laughs> These kids thought it's out of control. We got Amber Cole giving soppy toppy behind the school in her school uniform. Now you got Diggy, who's 16, taking naked pictures and sending them to probably Amber Cole. It's just, this is just ridiculous. So, um, check him off the list. His album is apparently, um, does he have an album out yet? That's a better question. Maybe we should answer that one first. Then we can get to the rubric. Because apparently everybody likes this single. I can't stand that damn song. That copy, copy, paste. I, I think it's tacky and it's janky. And I think it's, I don't, I don't like the song. You can copy, paste that. But apparently he needs a little boost. So might as well. Take a naked picture, send it out, send it to the paparazzi people or the internet people, and so you send it to me a takeout. You better believe it. it's gonna get around real quick because I'm some messy ass bastards and media takeout. Let me tell you, that's my change cup. Clearly, I don't have much change, but because I don't like change, I hate change and I hate carrying it around. So if I have to, I come home, drop it in a little cup because I don't like carrying cash. So. Change cup. But anyway, next person. Ugga ugga black booga ugga ugga out. Soldier Boy is next. So <laughs> should have saw this one coming. Soldier Boy was arrested uh last night I wanna say, or a night before last. The night before last, I believe, for drug possession and drug possession, um, carrying a firearm and something else. Just know Soldier Boy was selling drugs on the block and he they was doing a routine stop. He got caught and they checked his car, they found the drugs, the gun, and he was probably high. <laughs> so he was arrested and I think he just um got released on bail today and what's it called? Um, released on bail. Yeah, that's what it is. Released on bail. I just said it. And he went on. I don't. What did he go on? He went on some show and, or probably he probably went on Twitter. Let me find it. Uh, he went on something and started announcing how innocent he is. You were caught with the drugs and the gun. Like I don't understand when people do these things. And they're caught with the stuff. Why do you even go up there and put yourself through the fuckery and say, oh, I'm innocent. I didn't do it. You were caught with the stuff. You idiot. You would be better off saying, okay, I plead guilty, whatever. You soldier boy. Unfortunately, the way the system works, 
you'll get off with probably just paying a fine or something. Unfortunately, T.I. didn't, but you might. And I just don't know, how could you possibly go up there and say, I'm innocent, I didn't do it, it's a conspiracy. The conspiracy is you was caught selling drugs and you know it and you going down, down. President Obama, this is Kim Kardashian. I'll be going with the reading that. I don't know, I don't know why I saw they said he was, um, he pled guilty or pled not guilty. Knowing good well he was. That just makes me sick. But yeah, Soulja Boy is going down, down. He needs to be locked up for being illegal and stuff of that nature. And, uh, I'm really trying to find this for y'all so I can weigh in. But I do not see it. Maybe it's on World Star Hip Hop. It was on something. My internet will be acting slow while I'm recording, trying to find this for y'all. Just rude, internet. Just rude. This is why the Wi-Fi on campus sucks. Monkey marbles and things of that nature because it's janky. Oh, we were just talking about T.I. and he was on the view a few days ago. Or yesterday. Okay, I don't care anymore. Just know he's pleading, he's pleading not guilty. Like, he didn't do it. And let's check him off. Last but not least is my good friend, Shia LaBeouf, <laughs> who clearly doesn't know how to keep his mouth closed. For the umpteenth time, he then got drunk, slob kebab, and got into a bar fight. And this time, they got it on camera. They have the video of Shia LaBeouf outside a um, Vancouver bar. Apparently, he got wasted, as usual, went in the bar. Him and a guy got into an altercation. They were both put out of the bar. And once outside, crazy man that he didn't know, shot the buff, didn't know was crazy, came out his get up and whooped that trick. So, <laughs> the video is on TMZ. It's on Media Takeout. It's on World Star Hip Hop. Hell, it might even be on Facebook. So... I haven't watched the video yet, but I want to because I want to laugh. Matter of fact, it would be good to watch it while we're here. So let's find it. And then y'all can get a reaction. I'm going to make a video about Judas. But you know, I made a Judas video. Like, that was the first video I made. But that was like a whole year ago. And that was before I even decided to like sincerely do my YouTube channel. I was just doing it because I wanted to respond to that crazy girl who was crying talking about uh, Jesus and Judas are the same people and Lady Gaga going to hell. That crazy girl. I forget her name. Um, something about macaroni or... Um, Sarah Rooney or something like that. Crazy Charlotte, that's what I'm gonna call her. I'll bring him down, bring him down, down. Oh, here's the Soldier Boy story. Finds out jail claims he's innocent. You would, I would find it when I'm done talking about it. We talking about Charlotte Buff now. And how he got beat up outside the club again. Okay, I can't find a video right now. We'll go to TMZ, bro. All right, TMZ. I never go to TMZ because I'm not big on TMZ. I always go to either Media Takeout or World Star Hip Hop. Though I probably should go to TMZ first. I always go to like the black gossipy sites first because they usually have the messier stories that are more entertaining. And I'm hungry. My stomach growling. I'm gonna go downstairs to give me a quesadilla. Okay, I'll have to do a Shia LaBeouf review later because I can't find the video. So, that's all for today. Shia LaBeouf got beat down. Soulja Boy is going to jail. And Diggy Simmons is sexting his career up. That's all. Peace.